Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be reviewing this super, super spicy mock that I like to call the Before blood. Before we do begin, just want to remind you, leave a like, subscribe, and slap that bell if you're this video. And also check out Shelly Box. He is the inspiration for this build. Um, I, got the, I made the head he used in one of his videos, and some of the body of the mech itself is from one of his frame videos. So really check him out, he's got some super great contests. Here is a mech that I call a blood moon. Um, I built this in a total of about about two days, would be 48 hours I took to building, it, building this. And I'm on, overall, I think it's the best mech I've ever made in my entire life. Like, not kidding. Just taking a look around this, you can see over here, I have this custom made sticker. And this is a reference from LEGO Universe, one of the greatest LEGO video games of all time. But sadly, I never got to play it. I just watched the um, gameplay videos on YouTube when I ever got a chance. And I mean, yeah, you can see a lot of detail, a lot of detail on how to work one of this. Like for example, these two thrusters back here. Um, this amazing sword, which I actually built today in like two seconds. Um, and yeah, I, I, um, I use some printed or stickered pieces to my advantage here. And yes, you can fit a minifigure in there. I'm gonna show you that in just a second. Um, and yeah, pretty basic. I mean, there's not really much else to show except for the wings. And I guess now I can show you the interior. Well, not really the interior, the cockpit. So for the cockpit to open it up, first of all, move the head like that. Move it back another, because there are two joint connections here. Move these two parts back. Bring this, and then these you don't really have to move out, but then just take your finger out. Uh, and the hook here came off, of course. Okay, there. So then you just close it back. Ah, oh, the sword came out of the hand. So I'm just put it back like that, and yeah. just taking a closer look at the um, sword. So the blade itself is just like some tiles, with some really long tiles here. Let me take it out. There, and it, just two of them, and see like, and, and then you just put them together like that. But this side here is open, so you take this. You see this piece here, it just connects to that. Kind of, I mean, you can't really tell that it's not all connected. And then, um, I, I'm actually thinking of updating this piece with a T-bar instead, but I didn't have time to find a T-bar this morning. Then you got, you, I used one of these pizza slice pieces as like a guard or ink, um, wrist guard or whatever. I actually, I don't know if that's what it's called in like sword terms. So yeah, the blacksmith community is probably pissed off at me right now. And then, um, then yeah, I got, I used one of these older pieces well I, I think they're older i haven't seen any of these in lego sets recently so yeah, i use these on the back and oh and this this so the way it connects to the hand is so if you take a look at the hand there's not actually anything to hold on to a bar so the hand itself can't hold on to a bar so i take this piece here and put it into this technic pin that is used to connect the hand and the arm and then I just pop it in, and then I put the, these fingers down for uh, some extra support, and yeah, there it is. Honestly, to me, mechs are kind of like the spiciest part of Lego, really. I mean, they kind of start, started getting really popular with Ninjago, and I mean, that just went so, so far, and eventually evolved into this. And, um, actually, originally, this wasn't going to have wings, but then I found out, and I, I, I was thinking about what to use this extra ball joint here for, and I decided, why not just use wings? Or I could have been done, just done rocket thrusters, but that one have looked as cool, spicy, and stylish. And, um, yeah, that's pretty much it for the video, and, yeah, I'm just going to give you a little teaser for next video. These are probably super, super cringy, but don't judge me. I hope you did enjoy this video. Um, remember, like, like, leave a like, subscribe, slap that, and slap that bell so you never miss a video. And yeah, please check out Charlie Boss. He's pretty much the god of spicy Lego mechs. Um, and he actually just uploaded something a couple hours ago. So really check that out. And yeah, have a good rest of your day. Bye. Hope you did enjoy.